just wanted to say we're um, very happy to be in Tampa. Uh, the firm has been uh, based out of Pasco and Pinellas for, uh, since its inception in 1996. So this is something we've been thinking about for some time. And uh, Ed's our, our founder. And long before I was here, they were talking about this move. Um, a lot of our clients are national clients. And most of those have home base in Tampa. So we felt it was important to be here, to be uh, you know, around where our clients could conveniently uh, visit us. And uh, so we're really excited. Uh, we, we bought the floor and we've renovated about two thirds of it. And in a few months, we'll have uh, the other side as well. Uh, our tenants will be leaving and we're gonna renovate the whole thing. So by the middle of next year, we'll have renovated the whole floor. So uh, we're just, uh, we're, we're glad to be here. We think it's a great location business wise and you couldn't get a better building and a better facility. So we're very excited about it. Well, for, uh, for, for Frank and I, and for all the folks at the city and Christine, where we had a partnership, I mean, to see downtown come alive like it has in the last three years, I mean, who would have ever thought five years ago, six years ago, that this would happen? It's been transformative. I mean, not only are people moving back here, but companies are coming here. Uh, there's a lot of folks kicking tires on deals around town. There is so much momentum for downtown Tampa. I mean, this has become the destination. Absolutely. And it spreads to the adjoining neighborhoods. Frank and I were at a ribbon cutting out on Columbus Avenue, so you can see that prosperity start to spread. And, you know, it's all going to be connected in the next couple of years. And so thank you for uh, believing in downtown sure. and believing in the city of Tampa. Yeah. And as you know, I love the <laughs> <Park Rivers. laughs> Let me introduce you to our, our senior uh, folks. Um, Ed Mazur uh, is our founder and uh, he's chairman of the board. And Keith Mazur is our uh, COO. And uh, this is Rob Wright, and he's our executive vice president. And uh, you know uh, Cindy? For about 30 years now. Yeah, Cindy is our, is we our VP. We were 12. <laughs> <laughs> Cindy is our VP of planning. And, uh, and you know Al Belucha, who is also a senior VP here. So uh, eight people have moved in, into the facility already. Uh, and after we renovate, we'll be moving more, more folks. Uh, there's still 40-something back in the mothership. But uh, we're starting out with eight people here. Let's go get them all. <laughs> we'll be hiring for uh, new positions too for yes. the people in the Tampa area. Right. So. Yeah. Well, as much work is yeah. taking place, uh, yeah. you know, our permit activity is up 20% commercial, 25% residential. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's a lot of good stuff going. We got three quarters of a billion dollars worth of work coming out of the ground right now. I mean, just in downtown alone, in the next six months, what you're going to see is three new residential towers that will break ground. Uh, the, the federal courthouse uh, will be completed. The Aloft Hotel at the corner of Ashley and Kennedy will be completed. The Riverwalk will be done by Thanksgiving of next year. The Ulele Springs Restaurant mm -hmm. up on the north end along the waterfront will be done this spring along with the park that's getting redone. The last two parcels on Harbor Island, uh, one was sold for a high-rise residential. The second one is about to be sold for more high-rise residential uh, rental. Um, so it's, it's coming alive. And of note, the Alliance Hyde Park uh, residential product that's going in between Cleveland and Platt, that oh. is, that's our project. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yes. Right. We're doing mm -hmm. that. Yeah. yeah. Well, we've got that. We've got Crescent on the Bay Shore. Yep. We've got uh, Pollock Group up on the North Hyde Park area. You've got Post Hyde Park properties. Yep. Um, that one I've seen you clean, clear the ground uh, just recently. So, yep. Yep. so I mean, the next uh, year is going to be a very, very busy year for us. That's, that's a good thing. Because Frank and I love getting this property tax revenue. Because <laughs> we've got a lot of other parts of the city that need help, but we can't do it without, you know, you right. all building and growing and, yep. and doing things. So that's very exciting. Congratulations. We're ready. You ready to cut this thing? We are. All right. Here's the guy that's got the money in the deal. Why do I hold this? <laughs> I'm always deferential to the guys who have skin in the game. <laughs> yeah, they don't do it. Hey,